I found another project that you all have got to see. But first, would you like a piece of a $600 billion pie? More on that in just a second. $600 billion is the size of the global online gambling market? Yeah, and that's just the legal side. That $600 billion global figure is only going to grow as time goes on. So anyone that is going after a piece of that market share immediately catches my interest. But seriously, I have been investing long enough to know that just because a project could make me a lot of money, it certainly does not mean that it will. Not all that glitters is gold after all. And this up and coming betting platform, I'm gonna need you to smash that like button. Make sure you hit subscribe, boom! bang on that notification bell. Comment anything that you want in the relevant sections. I appreciate it. Now, let's go see what fortune holds for you in your future. The white paper has a lot of clarifying details when it comes to the project's business model. But what is this company? Chancer. I am almost sure that you've heard about them because they are literally marketing everywhere and they agreed to an AMA with yours truly. According to the white paper, Chancer is a peer-to-peer -peer or P2P custom betting platform. What does that mean? Well, it means the users can bet online and invite others to participate as well. And there's a really cool aspect of this, so pay attention. Chancer is running with the slogan, your game, your rules, your odds. That's nice, but it leaves me wondering if investing in this will be your loss or your gain. The platform is built on the Binance Smart Chain or BSC, which is a highly adopted chain that is currently only rivaled by Ethereum and size. So that's pretty solid. Bets on this platform are made with Chancer's native token, Chancer, which is used to reward participants for successful betting outcomes. Now, you might be wondering, how does Chancer make money? Well, they take a small percentage of each bet as a fee. And as a holder of Chancer tokens, you can bet on the platform and also make money by holding Chancer tokens and participating in the governance of the platform. So there's a little DeFi spin going to it. And Chancer claims to be the world's first decentralized predictive market making platform. That sounds nice, but what does that even mean? Because I'm sure most people just went cross-eyed. Well, predictive markets allow individuals to bet on the outcome of future events, such as sport games and elections. But is it basically a fancy way for Chancer to say that they are the first to offer betting on a decentralized platform? Well, if it is, I'm here to tell everyone that BetDex, DC Game, Fairspin, and Dex Sport already exist. These platforms are already operational and do essentially the same thing that Chancer is setting out to do. So this is going to come down to who has the best marketing and the strongest community. And I was starting to classify Chancer as a copycat of other betting sites, so I turned to the Chancer community to investigate what they thought. The active community helped me to realize that the differentiating factor was actually under my nose the entire time. A mod in the Chancer Discord explained that the phrase predictive market making platform was referring to the ability for users to literally set up a bet on anything and invite others to the unique bet that they had created. For example, I'll give you three to one odds that I don't wink anywhere in this video. You taking that bet? Well, you lose. <laughs> <laughs> All joking aside, this is actually pretty friggin' huge if they can pull it off. From what I could find, there are not really any other platforms trying to put this customization of the bet into the hands of the user. My only gripe that I have is that the messaging is not clear. So that's definitely a marketing opportunity. When I read predictive market making platform, I am thinking there's some type of AI involved that is giving me an edge on a bet, which would have immediately been a red flag because everybody's talking about AI right now and it's like a code word a trigger word, right? A keyword. But Chancer is really letting the making part of that phrase do all of the work and they need to capitalize on that. Overall, their unique value proposition seems to be in place, but they are still in pre-launch phase, so the execution is yet to be seen. For any project in the crypto space, the community is key. And Chancer actually checks this box with a strong community. Just listen to their follower accounts right now. Over 10,000 on Twitter, 5,500 in Discord, 10,500 in Telegram, and 2.6K on YouTube so far. That's pretty good for just starting. And those followers are important to help gauge the initial interest and long-term adoption of the product. But let's talk about some of the other claims that Chancer is making on their website and social media. They're claiming that their platform comes complete with live streaming. Incorporating live streaming into the platform means that users can watch the events that they're betting on in real time, similar to like watching those horse races in the casino. This is actually a really cool feature that makes sense to have on a betting platform, and it is on par with existing betting services like BC.game, Dex Sports, and Fairspin that all have live streaming as well. So let's talk about the team behind Chancer. The team is led by experienced professionals who are shifting their careers into crypto for the first time. The first co-founder and head of product is Paul Kelby. 
He has a dynamic background in recruitment, sales, and travel, and he brings a fresh perspective to the company. From his Instagram, you can see that he is a family man and he is a motivated hustler, which I can identify with. Now, his brother, Adam Kelby, is the other co-founder and is also the CEO. From Adam's LinkedIn, you can see that he has spent the majority of his career in ownership and executive corporate roles. The other Chancer team member is listed in the platform as the lead developer, Yuri Soda or Soida. I don't know. Maybe I botched it. Yuri has a robust background in software development and has a computer science degree from the University of Tokyo. I appreciate that the team is doxxed and they are not hiding behind a first name only like so many scammy projects that I come across that have fake profile pictures, fake names, whatever. Now, I'm not in love with the general lack of background in Web3 from the team other than Yuri's light involvement with NFTs and blockchain development, but the Kelby brothers do impress me by taking transparency even a step further. Adam and Paul actually started a pretty legit branded YouTube channel for Chancer that showcases the charismatic and fun personalities of the two founders. Remind you of anyone? All right, so the business model and team check out, but what are the tokenomics of the Chancer token? This is a crypto project after all, and the way you invest in this is to buy the Chancer token. So out of the 1.5 billion total token supply of Chancer, 65% will be available for the pre-sale, 15% will be allocated for product development, 10% for the centralized exchanges and marketing, 5% for the staking pool, and 5% for the decentralized exchanges, provisions, and liquidity pools. There were not any details about the tokenomics of Chancer outside side of two sentences and a graphic in the white paper though. I went back into the Chancer Discord hoping to find more answers regarding the token supply of the Chancer token. And I specifically asked if there was more info than what was in the white paper and I was only directed back to the same white paper. This was definitely a low point in my research on Chancer. As an investor, I need to know if the token can be minted by a centralized source and what the minting schedule might look like. So I would not say it should be a deal breaker for every investor, but until I have some assurance that Chancer can't mint new tokens, just whenever the hell they feel like it, then I will remain pretty skeptical on that. But hopefully they'll clear that up in the AMA. I know that'll be one of my questions. So should you invest in Chancer? First off, I can't tell you that, but what I will do is lay out some facts. It's a really unique project that's doing something different in the crypto embedding industries. Their team is professional and motivated and their marketing and branding of the project is actually pretty strong. But as with any investment, there are always risks involved. Crypto is a volatile market and the price of Chancer tokens can go up or it could go down. It's important to do your own research and make an informed decision before you invest. Overall, I think Chancer's a really interesting project that's definitely worth keeping an eye on. There's potential for it to be a success, absolutely. So if you're looking for a new investment opportunity, Chancer might be worth considering, at the very least looking into. But that's all I have for you in this video, and make sure that you show up to the Chancer AMA. I'm sure it's gonna be great. And let me know what you think about crypto betting platforms. Have you ever heard of a platform like Chancer that lets you set up bets on literally anything? Can't wait to see what you guys say in the comment, and can't wait to see you in the next video. Obviously, if you like content like this, make sure that you smash that like button. Make sure you hit subscribe. Boom! Bang on that notification bell. Comment anything that you want in the relevant sections. I appreciate it. Thank you so much for showing up to this video. I will see you in the next one. Have a good day, everyone.